Because that's what a nasty girl looks like. Hey, it's me, Eric, again, and I'm back with another awesome drink. This one is called the Nasty Girl. I think, you know, most guys, some girls even, have had a nasty girl at one point in their life. This is a shooter, and the reason I picked it today is because it just it caught my eye going through a book, and it's my first drink with dark rum. So I bought this, it was on sale, Goslings. It's commonly known as a fairly good uh, liquor for the price. So I bought that, decided to make a drink, and here we go. So, you know, there's a lot of stuff involved with this. Banana liqueur, uh, coconut rum, amaretto, the dark rum, of course, and the peach schnapps, as well as cranberry juice and pineapple juice. So there's a lot going on in this drink. Uh, the recipe should yield me about two shot glasses worth. So we're going to get started here real quick and make this drink. And we're going to have ourselves a nasty girl tonight. So a real simple drink. We're going to take three quarters ounces of the dark rum. And we're going to throw that into our tumbler. And everything else is just a quarter ounce. So literally everything else is just pretty much a splash. It's really hard to pour these without the pour spouts. I actually prefer to use pour spouts on these when I'm pouring them uh, this small of an amount, but I don't have them on. So I'm just going to use this measuring cup and hopefully get the right amounts. Okay, got all the liquor in there, and when it comes to the pineapple juice, it's going to be a dash. Same with the cranberry juice, just a dash. And once we have all that set up, just throw a little bit of ice into our tumbler so we can shake it. I think I officially have a huge mess over here. That should be plenty of ice. If anything, it's too much ice. But here we go. So we gave our nasty girl a shake, and now it's time to strain that biatch into some shot glasses. We're going to try. Now if I did everything right, this should hopefully yield me two shot glasses. Oh yeah. There might even be a little extra in there. Actually worked out pretty good. It's a nice thing about doing stuff at home. You can drink out of the shaker, you can do whatever you want. So that's it. That is how you make a nasty girl. And I guess, you know, I guess that's what a nasty girl looks like. Boy, that tastes mostly like dark rum and banana liqueur. It's actually pretty good for being a nasty girl. So, thanks for watching. Hope you try that recipe out. Hope you enjoy it. Uh, give the channel a subscribe if you really like it. Would love to hear your comments on this recipe. So, thanks for watching.